Assalamu alaikum guys. In this practical video, I will show you 8 big mistakes in the construction of floor beam with RCC slab. So let's get started guys. The first big mistake you can see which is about lapping length. The lapping length is placed at the distance of L by 4 which is one of the big mistake. If you are working on construction site, so you should see the structure drawing they will give you the place to provide lapping if you required. It doesn't mean if you require the lapping so you can place there. So this is not the proper steel reinforcement design. The lapping is not allowed at the distance of L by 4 but unfortunately they placed lapping on the top of this floor beam at the distance of L by 4. The second big mistake guys you can see the lapping cutting length is placed at the same point. So lapping should be provided alternately. But you can see here the length is equal for this lapping length. This is the second big mistake. If you see guys, if you require the lapping, so at the same place don't provide lapping horizontally and vertically. Guys you can see, they placed the lapping vertically also horizontally at the same place. So this is not allowed. Next guys you can see the spacing of stirrups which is about after L by 4 L by 4 distance the spacing is about 10 to 12 inches because this is one of the commercial building so the spacing of the stirrups should not be more than 8 inches after L by 4 but at the distance of L by 4 it should not be more than 6 inches. The fifth big mistake guys you can see the stirrup bend is you can see which are bent on 90 degree so this is the fifth big mistake the stirrup should be bent on 135 degree inside the floor beam but you can see and the length of the hook should not be less than three inches the sixth big mistake guys you can see here the lapping are the stirrup should be placed alternately especially the hooks but they placed at the same direction especially the hook sides. Next guys you can see this is the junction between beam and column but at this place they should provide extra steel rods or bent up bar but you can see clearly they placed two extra steel rods at the middle of this floor beam but they didn't provide at the distance of L by 4. This is about 4 feet but it should be provided at the distance of L by 4 but here the span between two columns is about 20 feet. The first stirrup should be placed at the distance of minimum 2 inches. You can see guys the spacing of stirrups are maximum. This is not the proper steel reinforcement for this construction. If you see on the other side, we have cantilever, cantilever beam. We have five steel rods in upper portion and three in bottom portion. Length of cantilever slab or cantilever beam is about five feet. You can see extra steel rod length is about here. 2 feet but this is not the proper steel reinforcement design. Next guys you can see this is the junction between beam and column. But they placed here lapping which is about 2.5 feet. This is not the proper steel reinforcement design therefore I am telling you you should hire the structural engineer to give you the proper steel structure design for beam column slab. It can help you especially in steel structure drawing but unfortunately they don't know they are just doing the steel reinforcement design by a steel fixer so therefore you will see the same result 
which you can see in this practical video therefore i'm telling you you should have a structure drawing for any structure member if that is beam column slab st uh, stair etc you can see the size of the beam is 12 by 18 inches as you can see here they did the same design here you can see the lapping which is about 2.5 feet at this place you can see the hooks of stirrups the spacing look here they placed the lapping length in upper portion and the junction so this is one of the big mistake do the proper design if you are working on site be careful especially for technical terms which can help you on construction site look here on the other side you can see everything is the front of you and this is four-story commercial building Lapping is not allowed at the distance of L by 4. So this is very simple. If you require it, so you have the proper place for which you can study the structure drawing. Hope this short video can help you. Thanks for watching. See you in next video. Goodbye.